Hello guys, I get this uh, old <coughs> car condenser for free at a second hand place where they uh, sell all kinds of scrap and I just look there and uh, the guy gave it to me because he didn't know if it's in a good condition so let's test it with an analog meter so the way to do it is I put my my meter will I put it on R times 1000 and I put the black lead the negative on the lead there hope you can see let me bring it into the picture and look at the meter if you go up and go down doesn't make contact Okay, there it is. Watch now. I, I <coughs> with my first test, I had it in the reverse position. So you put it there, and then on the body, you go up and go down. Okay, so if you turn your leads around now, and put the red there, and this one on the black, and it, do, if you do the same, it is okay. You can see. So this uh, condenser is fine and uh, I would like to test it on the farm wall because there's one thing I want to do on the farm wall and that is this is my current setup on the farm wall um, I've got a coil, 12 volt coil and I've got a condenser which is suspected at this point I've got a condenser and then I've got on the positive lead of the coil I've got a resistor on and uh, it goes to the front of the tractor to the battery and the, the negative is grounded to the body so what I'm going to do is put a lead on from this I just mark it there but I can attach it there on the positive take a wire and the switch, put the switch here and then the other side go to the positive to the battery so if I s s put the switch on it will bypass the resistor because current want to take the, the best and easiest route and I've got a better spark for starting and then once the tractor run I will just switch this off so this is my plan because um, I just want to create a better spark for starting purposes because the tractor sometimes start and uh, immediately die but it's a electrical problem sometimes he did it something sometimes not and I checked all the all the connections right through the tractor so I've got the suspicion that the condenser is not good on the tractor I'm going to put that one on and then we can test it but we will also put this wire in in the circuit just to excite my power to the points and then once it starts I will just switch it off and it go the normal route again ok guys so this is just a short video to show you how to test a condenser with the analog meter and uh, what is my plan on the farm wall which will be in the next video ok guys that is just a short video and thanks for watching and see you on the next one bye bye